again, my name's Gabe Zona. This is the 29th of January, 2019. Article posted by Fox News, written by Matt Richardson, R I C H A R D S O N. Published on the 29th. Title Roger Stone. Mueller will try to charge Trump, Pence, with hopped up frame of Russian collusion. There's an embedded video that you might want to listen to. It's 8 minutes and 20 seconds of duration. Former Trump advisor Roger Stone told Fox News on Monday that the indictment brought against him as part of special counsel Robert Mueller Russian investigation last week is really part of an attempt to silence him for his support of President Trump. This is meant to silence me, Stone said in an interview on Hannity. They're trying to criminalize legitimate political inquiry, Stone said. They're trying to criminalize free speech, which is really what this is about. Stone was taken into custody last Friday and indicted on charges of obstruction, making false statements and witness tampering. The indictment does not charge Stone with what you would think he'd be charged with, conspiring with WikiLeaks, the anti-secrecy website that published emails of Democrats during the 2016 campaign, or with the Russian officer whom Mueller says hacked them. Instead, it accuses Stone of lying about his interaction related to WikiLeaks, releasing during investigation by Congress and Mueller's team. The indictment stated that during the summer of 2016, Stone spoke to senior Trump campaign officials about WikiLeaks and information it might have that would be damaging to Hillary Clinton's presidential campaign. Now, why is that illegal? Huh? <laughs> it also said that senior Trump campaign officials contacted Stone to inquire about future releases. Why shouldn't they? Wouldn't you? And Stone continued to communicate with members of the Trump campaign about WikiLeaks. And why can't he? Freedom of speech. Huh? The 24-page indictment alleged that Stone worked to obstruct the House Intelligence Committee investigation into Russian interference in a 216 election by making false statements to the committee, denying he had records sought by the committee, and persuading a witness to provide false testimony. You mean false statements like if you like your doctor, you can keep them? If you like your insurance, you can keep that too? Huh? How about we're shovel-ready jobs? Huh? And then, <laughs> well, we really weren't shovel ready. <laughs> However, on Monday, Stone argued that the reason for the indictment against him was much simpler. Look, I honestly believe that they're going to try to charge the president and the vice president with some hopped up frame of Russian collusion, Stone said on Monday night. That way they can make House Speaker Nancy Pelosi president. She can make Hillary Clinton vice president and step aside. It's a nightmare, but I think that's what they have in mind. <laughs> there is no Russian collusion, he continued. I had not collaboration with WikiLeaks. I'm not charged with conspiracy. Believe me, if they could have made that case, they would have. But they want to silence because I would stand up for Donald Trump. That's what this is really about. In the interview, Stone once again reiterated his support for the president while doubling down on criticism of the Mueller probe. This is not only an effort to silence it because I support Donald Trump, and I've been a critic of the Mueller investigation, and I think Donald Trump is making America great again. He said of his relationship with Trump, he's my friend of 40 years. I have great affection for him and his family. I'm not going to testify against him because I possess no negative information. There is no Russian collusion. This is a witch hunt. Well, I think that if they could, they would. If they could indict and get rid of both Trump and Pence, they would. Problem is, Nancy's lost her mind. And it amazes me that she's allowed to continue as being thrown in line for the presidency. And again, what Stone did is what anybody would do. He's free to talk to anyone he wants, including Julian Assange. Thanks for listening.